Tonight, winter has arrived early for the vast majority of the country, with over 235 million people affected. Americans are enjoying below average temperatures. Temperatures ranging from the upper Midwest to the Pacific Northwest the Caribbean sea snow has fallen in October. Across the Midwest, including Michigan, Wisconsin, Indiana, as well as traveled as far south as Kentucky some regions seeing up to a foot and a half and more are on their way wind chills in Minnesota fell below zero. This morning, despite the fact that more than 100 million Americans are experiencing frost and freezing temperatures, the Rockies issued alerts tonight to the cold front will move towards the northeast. Temperatures ranging from 10 to 20 degrees below zero average from the Middle Plains to the mountains the Florida Panhandle and several other places will be affected. Set new lows with at least 75 tomorrow, records are anticipated to be broken. So there's a lot of news to cover. Evening, and CBS's Omar Villafranca will be there. Begin with in certain regions of the country, autumn feels like winter. Upper Midwest as a result of a meteorological system instead of rising temperatures, there will be snow. More than a foot of falling leaves parts of Michigan were buried with snow, leaving a mess for work unexpected crews thus much heavy snow because, in addition because to the heavy snow, we have several branches fallen. Inside the Marquette and Learnwood, Michigan more than 13 inches of snow fell in thick snowflakes sprinkled Indiana parking lots and highways contribute to slippery road conditions, and instead of the early snowfall had resulted in a white Christmas. Individuals considering a white Halloween I was hoped it would wait until closer to Thanksgiving, but hey, I know we had snow on Halloween. Before despite the fact that temperatures are decreasing the expense of heating a home is rising. The average expense of staying warm inside more snow is forecast this winter. Then a 17% increase of roughly 200 over the previous year because of the increased cost of gas naturel according to one energy expert we spoke with, home heating costs in Texas might rise up to 30% compared to the previous year it's the time of year in Dallas. Whiplash, it was in the 90s this weekend. Weekend, and now sections of North Texas are experiencing flooding there is a freeze warning if you loved the video please hit a like button and don't forget to subscribe the channel.